know it's high tech. I'm here with Ross Levinson. We are backstage at TechCrunch 50 as we have been. It's exciting backstage, isn't it, Ross? You know, yeah, Ringling, Ringling Brothers. So you used to be the head of Fox Interactive. Um, you were one of the geniuses who bought MySpace for a song, right? <laughs> and other moves. Um, and now you are a venture capitalist? Correct. So how do you like that transition? Uh, I like it. It's, uh, hey. oh, good lord. What are you guys talking do, about? Do you want to take over this interview? Yeah, well, ask him, because he answers, generally answers everything. Do you remember when you bought Nuru? I do. I love Nuru. <laughs> You're not going to fall on that thing again, are you? Again is the key word. What a nerd. Okay, so what back to question? serious matters yes. here. Do, do you I like, like being it? a VC? Yeah. I do. I, you is know, it more I, fun? Well, I, I think... Um, most fun I had, frankly, at Fox was putting it all together and, and talking to entrepreneurs, and, and mm -hmm. that was probably 10% of my job. So now it's 100% of my job, and, uh -huh. and I really, I'm amazed at how great entrepreneurs are, how hard it is to actually build a company, right? Um, and, and just being there to try to help them however we can, aside from with capital, uh, to me is a lot of fun. It's, it's a lot more fun than trying to manage politics of a big corporation. Right. When speaking of, you were just on an ad panel, and Heather joked that almost everyone from that panel had been at Fox Interactive Media at one point, including Heather. Former was the opposite. So, yes. you know, what What do we take away from that? Is FIM just screwed, or <laughs> <laughs> all the good people I mean, left? Well, it's interesting, because I think what you could look at that panel, and everyone who was at Fox has, has moved on to bigger, frankly, CEO jobs, or close to CEO jobs. So uh -huh. I think what it says is there was a lot of talent at that, that company. It's why we were able to move so quickly and, right. and do so many things. I, I don't think Fox is screwed. Fox is uh, one of the biggest companies in the world. Right. So I think it's evolving. John Miller and, and Owen and Jason Hershorn and Mike mm -hmm. Jones are going to take it probably in a good direction. Um, uh -huh. and, and, you know, MySpace still has 100 million uniques around the world, something like that. So. But what about momentum? I mean, have they just lost the momentum? Is that something the press talks about, or is that a real business problem for MySpace? Um, I, I think I think everything's magnified by the press. I, uh -huh. I, I certainly, MySpace um, and some of the other businesses have, have not accelerated. You can't ever continue to accelerate right, right, at, right. at those levels. Uh, I, I think they're in a transition period. The question is what happens on the back end of it. Mm -hmm. But you do have businesses like IGN, which are doing fine, and Fox Sports continues to grow. Mm -hmm. Rotten Tomatoes continues to grow, Ask Men. So there's a lot of under the cover stuff that doesn't get the attention that MySpace gets mm -hmm. that seem to be doing pretty well and were part and parcel of the whole strategy that we put in there. Mm -hmm. I think MySpace you know, grew so fast just at some point you tap out, I guess, unless you're Facebook, which just seems to be right. growing. <laughs> uh, but that too will, will slow down and they'll be faced and are faced with their own challenges. Mm -hmm. um, different businesses today. MySpace and yeah. Facebook really are different businesses. So a lot of the panel you were just on was about advertising and how a lot of, you know, this remnant advertising, cheap advertising to fill pages, it's kind of making publishers their own worst enemies. Um, who do you think on the flip side has been the most innovative as a startup at really making advertising work? Has anyone? Well, <laughs> um, well, I'm hopeful for the company that's about to go on, which is one of ours called Five to One, that's going to show a new take on it. Uh huh. Um, I, tough, you know, I, I think on the publisher side, scarcity is the critical thing. You just can't give it all away. Right. Because you do have ads that are generating 0.0, mm -hmm. right? That was the joke at the last panel. Mm -hmm. And I think you have to be really careful with your brand on one hand and your P&L on the other. Mm -hmm.